All right, all right, all right, everyone. My name is Echo Tango, and welcome back to Starbound. Previously, we explored a desert planet after we got our ship upgrade. And we also got several upgrades to both weapons and armor. Now, today we're just going to continue doing some, well, exploration, as you can say. And I would also really like to upgrade my ship further. And you can do so by getting crew members. So do you remember that one guy who gave us that one quest last episode? Well, it turns out, it, after, a, after a certain amount of quests completed, he'll actually request to join your ship as a crew member. So that is, ho that is hopefully what we're going to try to do today. And also, let's go back to here for a second. Where are they? These upgrade modules? We're going to need more of those to help upgrade our ship. So keep that in mind. But let's go back to that planet. Oh, a few other things to note right here. I bought, by the way, I actually hatched that robot chicken from the robot chicken egg I got on the previous episodes, and now this is him or her really all grown up. And and she's actually been laying some double A batteries for me every once in a while. And I should also point out to you that I did a, quite a lot of off-camera work, so a lot of mining, a lot of resource gathering. So I got a butt ton of tungsten and made them into bars. And Take a, look, take a look at this weapon right here. I found this, as, as well as a few other weapons, while I was just mining. And this is a legendary weapon. It is so good. Here, I'll just read the description here. Flamethrower, unique weapon, two-handed. It is so cool, man. I don't know if it has a right-hand thing. Okay. So, oh, okay. I never actually didn't... Huh. I actually didn't know we could do that. I haven't tried it. I haven't actually tried it, but that's what happened. Wow! Because I've only ever done the uh, left hand click, but I never actually did it. But so what happens is you actually have to try. Wait a second. So well, let's do it again. What happens if I do this? So this is trail. So that's what ha So you can. So this is if you want if you want to attack enemies as you're running away from them, but you want to. At least get some shots in so you can do that. Right? And of course, attacking enemies in front of you is pretty useful. I really like that. So, anyways, let's go down to Desert Vines. Okay. So, he does have a mission for us. Actually, I remember he's here. Locate. Okay, let's go ahead and check here for a second. Challenging Sly Molly. I actually, I actually got this mission um, not too long ago, and that was actually that was actually um, off. I actually got this mission off camera, is what I meant to say. So that's why I couldn't really show you me receiving it initially. <laughs> Sorry about that. So I'll just read it to you right now. An outlaw has escaped to our planet. An outlaw is on the loose. Rumor has it Sly Molly, the rogue soldier, is on the old stone arch above us. Apparently, she has been on the run ever since she got involved in illegal penguin wrestling. Can you go and take her out and make things safer around here? Am I sure I can? Well, that's actually... I think I probably should have just gone right to the arch myself. I completely forgot about that. Let's just go do that right now. Okay. Whoa! Whoa! I didn't realize you did that. Okay. I did not expect that. Let me just say that. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna get some food. Yeah, we're gonna get some we're gonna, we're gonna we're gonna eat something. Yeah, we're gonna go in guns blazing. Jesus, man. Rocket launchers all the way.
I surrender. Put away your weapon. Oh. I just killed her anyway. Huh. Alright. Well, that's quite interesting. Let me, go, let me go ahead and just cut this tree down. But she was already on fire. I don't think it really matters. Oh! I don't think it really matters what happens to enemies like that. To rogues. So... Um, anyways, let me just beam up, and then I'll meet back with Enzo. Okay, we're back. Oh, I'm sorry, he's sleeping right now. Let, let's just wake him and tell him the good news. When he's, well, willing to wake up. Oh, okay. Did you manage to defeat Molly? Who needs guards with you around, huh? Thanks for your help. Okay. But he has have a mission ready for us. Okay. I'm worried about my colleague Nevada. I was out running with my colleague Nevada earlier today when we were separated. I saw some alien avian raiders sneaking around and worry and worry Nevada has been captured. I last saw her near the depths of the alien temple west of us. Can you go and find her? Huh. Okay. So there is something very interesting out here. I mean now every planet has is gonna have some sort of like a good like a good place and a bad place. So we're gonna go ahead and take a look at that. So actually, let's go ahead and beam up, and then we're go, and then we're gonna go west. So then. And then we're going to take a journey west of here. So, let's head west. I'm going to do a jump cut until we, re until we reach the alien pagan temple. Or until we find something interesting. Wait, speaking of interesting. Hmm, what stuff is that? Okay, anyways, as I was saying. There we go, we're going to continue moving. Oh, oh I found someone. <laughs> well, that's always interesting. Okay. Weapons out. I mean, weapon. Excuse me. Hello. I don't know if you mind me taking your stuff. Huh? If you like sand, you're in the right place. Hmm. Quite interesting. I don't know if you're a merchant or anything. I don't, and I don't even know if you mind. If you mind if you mind taking your stuff. Huh? Hmm, that's quite interesting. Anyways, here's what he has. Or she has. A Manticon Matterquake. It's a hammer. I guess I'll just take that. Look at all that. Oh, I forgot to open this bag. Sorry, what am I doing? Let's open it. See what I get. Oh, look at that. A Graxus Heart Fighter. It says two-handed sword. But right now, I'm pretty sure weapons are pretty good right now. Well, it was quite nice to meet you, though. It's quite nice to meet you. Oops. So, as I was saying... At this point, we're just, I'm just going to go ahead and do a jump cut until we get to the temple or until I find something interesting. Alright, so, as for now, I'll be right back. Hold on a second here. I found... Hold on a second, hold on a second. Okay, okay, everyone, just hold on a second here. Okay, so, I, I mean, I wasn't just, I wasn't far out of the jump cut, but, um, so I, I just came across this tar, these tar pits, I guess you could call them, with oil in them, and I came to this area, and then look what I found. I found an upgrade module, and a Grax's Nebula, 
Nebulite Destroyer. It's, a, it's, a, it's just a common pistol here. Let's, 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 go, let's, let's go check it out, see how it works. This one here, but wow! Mm, I don't know. Not that great, I'd say. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put, put my axe back because I really like my axe. But hey, that upgrade module though, that's a good find because I know I need at least two for the uh, for the first ship up for the next ship upgrade. And I don't know what the heck I'm coming down. Oh, okay, it's just I guess it's just another tree. All all trees will just drop down. Hmm. Well, I thought that was interesting at least. Well, I'm just gonna go ahead and clear out this whole area, and then, of course, like I said before, the jump cut. So, I'll be right back. You know, this place never, never stops giving you some interesting stuff here. Let me tell you that. And all these bones, and, and I found this house, and I already looted it, but I didn't find anything particularly interesting. Okay, well, okay, actually, maybe this grenade launcher. Maybe I'm not. I'm not sure. <laughs> Is there okay? Calix Solar Slayer. Quartz, uh, it's a guided rocket. Fourteen point three shots. Yeah, let's go. Let's go ahead and give that a try. Wait, how much energy does it use? Oops, sorry, not, not that one. I mean, I do definitely like the range weapons. We'll give it a try. I think we'll give it a try. That's better though. Okay, that's 14.2 damage. It's just 14. Oh, 14.3 damage. Fortunately, I won't have my shield though. I like my flamethrower. Okay, you know what? let's just go. Let's just keep going. So, look at us continuing to venture through. We got these gates here. We got something out here. Oh, it's just a bone pit with oil in it. Well, I can get out. It's easy as I said. Okay, I'm in! A lot of oil. Bed? Of course, a bed. <laughs> I mean, what what else could it be, you know? So many, so many interesting things on this planet. Looks everything, everything's all right here. Nothing of interest. Oh, oh camp. Oh man, navigating these oil fields is. This. What? 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 What is that? Oh jeez. You put fire into oil, well, well, of course something bad's gonna happen, but... Hmm. Well, that's interesting. Found some radioactive barrels. Pretty dark now, it's hard to see. Well, at this point, I'm not really expecting much interesting, except... Well, obviously, something dangerous. Well, I'm expecting a lot of tar pits from here. So, again, like I said, jump cut. I'll be right back. Huh. That was not a lot of time at all between that jump cut and, well... <laughs> well, until we reached our destination. But we're here. We are here, my friends. And let me go ahead and plant a tree. Um, so, get ready. We could be seeing some enemies pretty soon. Oh, oh, jeez. Oh, hostiles. Hostiles. I see how it is. Oh, okay. Anyone else? Oh, 
This book looks ancient. Intricate works scratch at the surface, but I can't make them out. I think it's a winged urn, full of ashes. Well, this is avian. But there's nothing else out here, though. Well, I just realized. Man later has his own flashlight. I'm not seeing much else around here. You are unwelcome, stranger. Excuse me? Do you want me to kill you? An altar covered in avian carvings. Perhaps this is their god? The thing looks like it might fall apart in the slightest touch. I wonder if there's anything inside. Blood and feathers. Dark. Okay, now we're just asking for it. Stand down. Or I won't harm you any further. Okay. I really like the design of this place. But anyways, the true enemies lie below us. Not much out here. Enemy. Oh, oh jeez, there's so many of them. Place is dangerous, man. Stone table, maybe a dining table, judging by the way it's worn. I just wonder, can I? Hmm, okay, that doesn't really. Okay, I don't really unlock much with that. Let me just put it back. Alright. There's something else on that side. Oh, someone dropped a someone dropped an upgrade, a tech card. Oh Jesus! They must have come have they, they those must have come from one big bird. Guys, they really want to pick a fight with me, don't they? Oh, someone drops out. Man, they're everywhere. Daylight outside, as I can see here. Oh, he died. <laughs> the fire killed him. Smells like it has rotten fruit inside. Smells like rotten flesh. I don't want to think about this right now. Man, this, this is really
Wait, did I put all those there? I don't know I'm putting all those there. <laughs> The old statue has both the history of Kluwex and the statue of him. He looks long, like a snake. Is the sun of special significance to an Indian? Hmm. Okay, that's an interesting place we can go. Man, there's a lot of things. There's a lot of This is very interesting. I don't think those are our dimensions. So that's this is the end of this is the end of this area. The the west wing. West wing. Oh. Get some food. No, oh, I can make sand with it. <laughs> nice. I've always wanted to hit one of these. Oh, yeah. We sure do, don't we? More. Oh, there they are. Melee, finish it off. Anything down here? If I warm up the water, I think what is if I warm up the water, I actually can get some heal. That's cool. On this side. So this ends this concludes the west wing of the temple. Now let's go to the east wing. Go south. Oh jeez. I guess. I got a music box. Huh. Jesus. Oh, there's... Oh, my. Okay, well, I found the Raiders. The Indian Raiders. I 
shield broke. Still alive? You saved my life. Thank you. Can you take me home to Enzo? Just to be on the safe side. Of course. Holy cow. Well, we found him. Holy cow, did we find him? They're down here. Oh, they're still in the I actually don't know where I'm supposed to be going right now, huh? I know it's up. But there's gotta be a west way. Oh, Jesus. Or stay behind me. And able to help reunite Enzo with their colleague. I'm sure they'll find their way to each other without, uh, without my help. Dang it, no! Oh man, oh, I'm so sorry. We had to get you out of there safely. I'm not a good, I'm not a good, I'm just going it all in. I found out there's a dangerous outlaw nearby. We have a situation. Have you heard of the outlaw Lightspeed Masami, the Grenegade Samurai? I've heard she is laying low nearby after she failed a heist on a group of famed traveling adventurers. We don't need that kind of trouble around here. Could you go to the Raised Wind Hut to the east and sort her out? Well, I guess I can do that. Hi, Enzo contracted me to help you fight the Renegade Samurai. Sweet! I'm actually not appropriate to ask avians to give you their feathers. Hmm. Oh, that's good to know. Alright, let's go up. Should have just got out while we had the chance. Still not happy about that mission. Ugh, we failed it. Raise wooden hut to the east. And I died too. I of course, I died that episode too. Is this it? You've come to stop me, so be it. Oh, whoa, whoa! What was that? You deployed pets. to surrender? I guess not. Oh well, my job here is done. Alright, I'll meet you guys back at Enzo. And I just realized I didn't have that, I just realized I did not record me getting the reward. Man, I mean, I'm still so bothered over my loss just now, you know. But anyways, I got my reward. Here it is. Where is it? Okay, actually, we're gonna upgrade our weapon like this. And there's our reward. 
You got a Calux Wave Hailbird. So let me know when you have another mission, alright? I'm jealous of you being an adventurer, yeah. Yeah, so anyways, I'm gonna go sort out some of my inventory, and then we'll be right back. Okay, so there are a few things I actually want to go ahead and share with you since we're back on board the ship. Um, one, we got our first musical instrument. Music box. A music box. Is this a wind-up? So I don't know what happens when you use it. Oh, okay. 12 day. Okay, so... Oh, wow, I can access the songbook library and just play any song here. Oh, Jim... Oh, I know some of these. I know some of these. I like a lot of these pieces, actually. Verley's, Jim No PD, Park Terrell's <laughs> Christmas songs. Interesting. They actually have the Stardew Valley theme here. That's cool. That, that's really cool, you know. That's really cool. Okay, actually, wait, hold on a second. And then we actually got a codex. Avo script verse 23, 4, 27. We got this from the Avian Temple earlier. Oh, yeah, I got all this from Avian Temple, let's just say. Well, this is quite interesting. So, I mean, I'm not... I'm not uh, so actually, I think from now on, I'm not going to go ahead and read all these codexes. You can just go ahead and pause the video and read them on your own time. I'm going to, of course, and of course, I'm just going to go ahead and read them on my spare time. But, and also, okay, the next thing, the next thing, is we're going to do some more Matter Manipulator upgrades. So we got, what is it, we got 10? No, no, we got 12 total. No, we got 14 total. I'm sorry, 14 total. But let's actually increase our area of effect. I think that would be a good idea. Yeah! Ah, oh, that's so good. Now, anyways, I'm just going to go ahead and continue to do some exploring around here. Maybe Enzo might have a new mission for me. So, at that, so at that point, I will be right back. Yep, he has a new mission. Alright. Outlaws escaped to our planet. We have a situation. Have you heard of the outlaw Sly Marley, the rogue soldier? I've heard he is laying low nearby after he stole all the furniture from the town. We don't need that kind of trouble around here. Can you go to the raised wooden hut to the east and sort him out? Okay, same place we found that, what's that samurai woman or something like that. So, I end, I end a contract me to help you fight the rogue soldier. Mm -hmm. The universe is a big scary place. Well, I can't, I can't really remember how to get up here. But I'll, I'll take you along. I'll take you along. So anyways, let's get back to the wooden hut from here. No, nope. And of course, I'll be right back. By the way, I died en route back up here. By fall damage. That's, real, that's really embarrassing. And um, unfortunately, the Hyrie... He's not, he's not, he's not with me anymore because I died. Anyways, this, this is oh boy, he's got a gun. He's got a gun. Go back to Enzo now. All right, we're back. Did you manage to defeat Marley? I'm so glad you're help. You're here to help with this. Oh, oh, he's in uniform right now. Enzo would like to join your crew as an engineer. Invite Enzo on board. Job engineer, rank temporary relief engineer. Status: tired after a long day of doing nothing. Yes, I got my I got my first crew member. Yes, let's do it. <laughs> Good to have you around, Enzo. I'm so very sorry about about your colleague and, and his friend. That that I I I hold to all responsibility. Man. I hold to all, all responsibility. Now let's, let's meet up and meet up. Let's go. Let's let's go back to the ship and meet up with Enzo. 
You found your first crew member. Mm -hmm. Talk to me. Uh, talk to me on your ship to manage crew members and monitor their status. <laughs> He's asking what just happened. <laughs> Enzo. Name Enzo. Okay. Okay, this is how I can manage the crew. Okay. So. Anyways. Oh, there's a, I forgot, I forgot a battery. But anyways, I think that's really all the time I have for today. Um. Thank you all for watching. I'm still trying to figure out, is that enough time? It feels like it's not been, I feel like that's, bar that's been barely any time whatsoever. I'll take a look at the timestamp. I'll take a look at how long this video's been running. But anyways, thank you all for watching today. If you liked what you saw, then, le then leave a like down below. It helps me out very much. And if you really want to see more of my content, why not hit that subscribe button? It'll help out me, and it'll help out you. So once again, thank you all for watching, and until next time, I'll see you around.